อิติปิโสภะคะวะอะระหังสัมมาสัมวัดชาวอินเพรกิอ t ม่ลุกไลค์สมัยชินเทมเพลแต่มันถูกสร้างขึ้นในปี2004ในการแสดงถึง200ปีที่ผ่านมาจากรัชกาลของพระราชาอาณาจักรไทยแลนด์คุณสามารถคิดว่าที่นี่ถูกสร้างขึ้นในสองส่วนที่แยกกันเป็น3ส่วนที่แยกกันเป็นสองส่วนที่แยกกันเป็นสองส่วนที่แยกกันเป็นสองส่วนที่แยกกันเป็นสองส่วนที่แยกกันเป็นสองส่วนที่แยกกันเป็นสอง This is obviously the top of the mountain, and this area has a number of small temple complexes and statues of the Buddha. Below this is the temple complex where the road ends, and you have to walk to the top from. The third temple complex is at the bottom where you have to park your car to catch the shuttle up the steep and winding road. Wa c h a o i m p r a k i a t is in c h e h a m District, Lampang Province. Unfortunately, there's no good public transportation option to take you there. You will need to get there with your own transportation, either a car or motorbike from Chiang Mai, or by hiring a private car and driver. You can also book a tour either online or in Chiang Mai. The temple is a two and a half hour drive from Chiang Mai and one hour from Lampang City. Once you arrive, you park at the temple at the bottom and pay the entrance fee and for your ticket on the shuttle. The road up is steep and narrow, and they sensibly only allow their drivers to use it. The shuttle is really just the common s a n g t h i u pickup truck with two rows of benches in the back. After a slightly nerve-wracking ride, you will be dropped off at another temple most of the way up the mountain. From this point, you still have a 20 to 40 minute walk up to the pagodas at the top. It's almost entirely uphill, so it's fairly strenuous, but there are lots of places to sit and rest on the way up. There is also some rain cover along the path. The path is well maintained, and anywhere it gets steep, there are steel stairways with hand railings. You could do this in flip-flops if you were used to it, but you would be better off in decent shoes. Once you're at the top, just look around and enjoy. There are plenty of places to explore and different views and vantage points you can get. Take your time and move through slowly, as there are lots of small but beautiful details. Remember that many of the people visiting are there for religious reasons and to honor a revered former king of Thailand, so be respectful. We recommend the rainy season from June November as the best time to go. For one thing, the rains mean even fewer people than usual. The water also makes the forests that grow out of the jagged limestone really lush and beautiful. The clouds floating by and occasionally enveloping the pagodas in fog create an incredible atmosphere. Tip: Since Wa c h a l i m p r a k i a t is popular with Thais, you should not visit during weekends and public holidays if you want to avoid crowds. Besides rainy season, the cold season from November through January is also a great time to visit. The mountain may still have some nice clouds and should still be pretty green. You want to bring a warm jacket as it will be cold. During the hot and dry season from February to May, the north of Thailand has its notorious burning season. The trees will be brown and dry, and the views probably won't be very good due to the haze. At certain times, the air even gets to unhealthy levels for breathing. The exact start and end dates of the burning season vary year to year depending on the rains. If you are already in the north of Thailand at this time, it's worth a visit, but you're much better off going at a different time of year. As this is a temple, it's important to dress modestly. Men and women should have their legs covered at least to their knees. Tank tops, vests, singlets aren't appropriate, and women cannot show any cleavage. There is nowhere to rent sarongs or coverings at the temple, so you should go prepared. You should also bring sun cream, a jacket during cold season, and rain protection during monsoon season. If you'll be up there early morning or late in the afternoon, taking some mosquito spray can't hurt. And of course, you should take your camera. We hope you enjoyed this video of Watch Alan p r a k i a t If you did, please hit the subscribe button and like us. Also, leave a comment below. Thank you.